And now we have our uh, empty useless ROM folder where we're going to put our uh, new material here. So we know that we're going to be working with this branch right here. We're going to try our repo sync command that we uh, changed, hopefully for the better. There we go. And so, uh, of course, we need to uh, take a look in here. We'll look at all files, and we see that we've got our repo folder there that's hidden. And if we change directory into that repo folder, we can see our manifest. If we cat our manifest, oops, dot XML, we can see it's there. And we see, of course, uh, we could see the change that we made. not I guess hmm. interesting oh um no well, that should be right Hold on. let's take a look here and see what we got going on control H see our hidden files oh of course uh, Apollo starts with a capital A and so uh, when I was doing my search, I missed it. But okay, so uh, now we are ready to run our repo sync. Um, and we could take a depth of one um, or uh, you know, do a few things to try to save ourselves some space or just do our repo sync uh, complete as is. Actually, I think uh, what we want to do is <laughs> repo init with a depth of 1. I think that makes more sense. Depth equals 1. There we go. And then if we do a repo sync dash C, so we're only checking out the one branch that we want, uh, it should help limit our download size. So this is going to take a while for this to synchronize, and we'll come back and check it out once uh, once that's done.